Yo, what is going on guys, it's Cryptic TMG and I'm back with a brand new video and finally we're here with a newer set of course of DLC with all the new cars and the new track Zamvort and yeah, I had to get this one out there, first day, first upload, I had to get it done, McLaren 720S um, hot lap and setup video and yeah, this is one I'm going to actually talk you through man, this car is, it's got such a nice feel to it, it feels really steady, really nice balance but um, yeah, I'm going to be banging out all the setups, man. This is what I've been waiting for. I know I haven't been uploading that many setups recently because I knew this update was coming. I wasn't sure what it was going to do to the BOP. So I didn't want to make a ton of setups and then have to just change everything I've done. So basically just wasting everyone's time. But yeah, absolutely great car. Um, it's the first time I've actually get, got to driven a 720S uh, GT3. So um, pretty happy with that. Um, love the track. I've always liked Zanvor. Um, one of my favorite tracks in the original set, of course, so I always used to drive it. But yeah, let's get stuck into this video. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope I don't sound too bunked up as I have a ridiculous cold at the moment. But um, yeah, coming into the uh, first straight now, um, quite important to get a good run off the last corner. I've got to try and stay as flat as you can. Some cars tend to understeer, but braking pretty late at the 100 meter board for turn one. Try and take a sort of early apex and trying to sort of make the corner into a v-shape if you can so you can get on the power as early as possible this corner i like to gear up just before and then gear back down keep it in third gear balance the throttle a little bit you want to break again make another v-shape if you're too close to the apex in this corner you get a pretty poor run out of it try and stay off the curbs too much because it does knock some of your speed down and now it's about taking the least line of resistance um don't touch any of the curbs you will lose time it does unsettle the car this is such a tricky corner coming up i decided to brake a little bit earlier in the mclaren 720s because it had a little bit of understeer through here so down to third gear get on the power quite quick swing the car left and then right just over the curb can unsettle some cars but it was pretty nice in the 720 um, yeah, turn in pretty late here, try and take a later apex so you can get on the power a little bit quicker. Swing all the way to the right again, back down to second gear and you have to wait an age it seems to get on the throttle through this corner. But good exit in the 720 some cars tend to sort of understeer on the exit and it feels like you're just losing so much time. Again, this is a tricky corner, you break at the 100 meter board, try and get it just launched over the curb a little bit on the right hand side, it'll pull your car around a little bit. Um, be patient, don't get on the throttle too early here, otherwise it spits you out towards the curb and you lose time on the run to the last couple of corners. Now, a little bit of the car over the curb on the right hand side, keep your foot buried in, be as brave as you can, you want to be flat out for the last corner. It's such a quick lap but such a busy lap, um, really enjoy this track and yeah, going across the line now, you'll see the 720S, 720S sorry, managed a 36.3, so not too bad in terms of pace, um, pretty nice to drive. But I would say um, I think there's still room for improvement. The car definitely it's, it lacks something. I'm not sure what it is, but I don't feel like it will be one of the overall quickest around this track. But it's definitely one of the nicest to drive. Um, I'll leave you guys in the replay. I hope you enjoy it. Scripted TMG. Like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to catch my videos first. Also, make sure you go and follow me on Twitch. And yeah, peace.